with stars. Long drive, palm trees in the beach. Got everything in Cali.
Wow. No, I, I, it seemed to be on a loop. <laughs> I don't think it was ever going to end. I honestly don't think that was ever going to end. People are not. Is that like eight words all in a row? Constantly she's over still and there, over too? And over again? Oh, my God. She's there. Well, I am. Yes, I am. Of course she's there. Hi, girl. How are you, girl? I love you. <laughs> I love her. I'm great, actually, <laughs> since I'm talking with you people. I love her. We're, we're really she's glad to be able to help in any way we can. Kurt, um, do you have any oh, you, more questions oh, for her? He, oh, yeah, he did. He wanted... Does anybody else have a question first? I Who else have I got on here? I want to hear that uh, good-looking um, man that talked good. Hey, Jeff. Jeff, are you there? I don't know if he's... Oh, uh, yeah. He fell asleep. You all... Talk to me, brother. Oh, there he is. Hi. <laughs> okay, no. I got a, I got a question for Jeff. If, if you, oh, is it okay? Can I ask? Yeah. Jeff, right. He sounds revealing? like... Who's that now? That man sounds Eric. like... What's his name? Eric uh, the Wolf Troll. Eric. <laughs> 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 That's a cool uh, so half troll, half wolf. Like sound like you like that? I think I'm going to roll with that for a while. Okay. Like the wolf troll. I like that. Really? <laughs> Say, I'm Eugene. Okay, well, we, can you postpone your love affair with this lady for a minute, Kurt, so we could talk to her and ask her some more questions? <laughs> yeah. So I'm not I know that. she's loving it, but we we want to we want to understand uh, more. Okay. okay so I. Put let's, them yeah. When she was 24, she had that ex- 25. She had that experience in the park, and and then can kind of take us. What, what sort of experiences did you have in your late 20s and early 30s? Is there anything that happened during that time frame that you can share with us? In my uh, late 20s, around 27, 28, I weighed about 145 pounds. Um, at 20. Seven, I lost my children because their father loved weed but didn't want the children to know that he smoked it or his wife or anybody else. So he decided he, so he decided he would uh, talk my daughter into convincing family and children services I was a drug dealer. And to be taken away from me, my son wanted to stay with me, but they had to go into care. And then their father uh, successfully got to court and said that he had a wife and a house and a this and a that, all because of me, because I grew a wonderful crop and he sold it. And uh, he made all the money. I didn't, I didn't profit nothing. And uh, he bought a house, a car, and everything else, and got married, and then uh, proceeded to get my children so he wouldn't have to pay support. What a lovely man. Lovely man. Uh-huh. Yeah, it was, it, it was almost like because he found out, because we were together, that and he found out all the stuff that happened to me in small bits and pieces throughout my life before him. He had to treat me worse and worse and worse and worse. The more I told him, the worse I was treated. Like by the time our relationship ended, uh, we had to move here because we were broke. And we had just moved into a house that I couldn't afford alone. And uh, he decided to touch my sister. And she was only 14 years old. And that was the end of that. I lost the house in the same month. And uh, I had less than 10 days notice to get out. She's and uh, she, she had already taken everything I had to even I'm make dollar. money. And have my oh. half. And, and um Oh, I'm so sorry. He proceeded. He yes, I don't know. He proceeded to make me <laughs> lose weight by vomiting everything up for like three years after I had our son. Mm. So that so made me not have any 
respect for myself, but yet when he touched my daughter that or my sister, that ended everything. That was when it was over. I had no cares about him anymore. He got charged. He had weekends. He laughed in my face. Hmm. And for the whole seven years we were together, it was called it was date rape. Yet yeah, that was never brought up at all in court because I was in the hospital for a mental breakdown because of what happened. No. Couldn't go to court. The no, doctor wouldn't let me go to court to, to bring up my statement in, in court. Hmm. I hear a lady. It happened for seven years. Seven years of trying to keep a pig off my back. Hmm. And when I and I and when I was twenty seven, I actually uh, weighed one hundred twenty five pounds. And by the time I weighed, uh, by the time I was 35, I weighed 225, or 325. That sounds fine. You know what? I'm only, uh, I lost 185 pounds now. How did you do it? Do it. Willpower, power. Perhaps we could work something out. Quit, quit <laughs> joking about that. Don't do fake. Uh, don't do that. This is serious stuff. Shh. Don't do that. Do that. No willpower. If you don't have willpower, no. you get a scooter, you sit around, and you keep riding it. If you have willpower, you get off the scooter, you sell it to somebody else, and you walk your ass. What a great girl. Uh, yes, sir. Shh. Stop that. All the government's doing is giving these guys scooters so they can stay fat. That's all they're doing. Somebody molested. She molested. Oh, Why couldn't you just run away and just take off, go somewhere else? You were a little kid. No, no. I'm talking no when pepper. she's talking about this this man that when she was like uh, pretty much. You don't know better. Date, date rape and molested they, by this guy for seven years. They coerce you into it, okay. and you can't can't you can't get out of it. It's yeah. like. Once you're in it, you think that's your only, that's yeah. all you have. That's all you have. And yeah. I was pregnant. And I was like, I would say four you're months pregnant, pregnant and then all his friends sat me down. Oh. All of them. Mm. Every last friend he ever had in his life from the time he was a child on. Oh, God, came to me and said, girl. Chris, we got to talk to you. Please sit down. I was four or five months pregnant with my son. Wow. And they said, He's been cheating on you, and he's got a disease. <sighs> While I was pregnant. Mm. Hmm. So I found oh, out he has been sleeping with strippers. So I confronted him in front of his friends. Take another drink, uh, girl. <laughs> I had to confront him because I, I knew the baby was at harm, in harm's way. Thing. So I I'm took him to the health unit. We got tested. He had given me chlamydia. And if I would have given the birth to my son, he would have been blind. So thank God his friend sat me down and told me about it. I love you, girl. You want to hear something else? When I was yeah, 13, everything I had my you have first to say. Son. Yes. Please. I was 13 throughout my whole pregnancy. Had my son two days after my 14th birthday. Wow. Mm. I had no rights to him oh. because I was 14, so my mother signed him away. I had signed seven him days away. with what? him in no. the hospital. Stop. They had to inject me with a needle to make me leave so the adoptive parents could take him. The and I didn't even know that the adoptive parents that adopted my son were related to my son's father, which makes them brothers and cousins through um, adoption. Do you know your son now? Yes, I do. He's in, in BC. Huh? He lives in British Columbia. And your uh, love, do you love each other and know each other? We know each other, love each other, yes, but we don't. Uh, communicate. 
Oh. There were some harsh words said. Go ahead. Go ahead. From, from, from when you were... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, Lord. Daughter and girl. Thank you. Shut up. Don't do that. Okay. A total silence here. Did we lose her? Yeah, yeah harsh words weren't meant to hey, shout out to it was just okay. bring across the okay. fact. Shout out to Space Down Radio in the chat room, all right. This is unreal, is what I had said to him. That's just so. Yeah, this is for a crazy, my, crazy, crazy to, show. For me to, my, in my life, to hear that that happened to you. It just, I could cry all day, ma'am. I could yeah. cry all day. Some people have had amazing lives. I wish you could just get a glimpse of one, one life for the rest of my life. Mine. I could cry all day Better. about you, girl. Um, <laughs> that sounded like Doctor Phil in there. Well, uh, yeah, I felt cool. yeah. Let her talk. Let her talk. I'm sorry. Shh. Let's get real. If we're going to be real, let's be real. Oh, shut up. Uh, yeah, I don't think he's real. Up. I don't think Dr. Phil's real. I think she talked. Anything she says out of her mouth is great. Go ahead, girl. I don't know. I wanted to talk about uh, other situations, but it's just so depressing. It's hard to keep talking about it. Well, go ahead. Okay, you're you're tell, teaching us. How about there's a uh, positive to side to the story? Shh. Positive side to the story. Hey, so I. You got a pot garden. Yes, I got a beautiful pot garden. Let's talk about. <laughs> let's, let's talk about that. <laughs> I have Ballad Donna, Donna, White Widow, Original. I have Nebula. I have. Uh, uh, <laughs> There's one called CBD Skull oh, Cakes, Chernobyl, <laughs> um, Belladonna, uh, Jackie, uh, Jackie White, White, Sweet oh, Purple, and... Hey, man, if you want some, uh, I got Labrador Gold, man. <laughs> 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 my, my dog, <laughs> my dog ate all my stash, man. My dog ate all my stash. <laughs> and, and I'll tell you, man, I, Oh, we we had to follow him around and, and put it in bags, <laughs> and, and then we dried it out, man. We dried it out. She's got to It's still good, man. I'll send you some. It's still mm -hmm. good, man. I'm going to call her. <laughs> now quit. Let her talk. <laughs> it's hilarious. Oh, jackpot. <clears throat> pot. Oh, I she get it. Pot. Quiet now. Let he, her uh, talk. Jack, pot. It's Jack's pot. Shh. Quiet. This is Chris's pie. She roll one. We're trying to cheer you up. You are. You guys are doing an amazing job. You know that. I haven't felt this good in like years. <laughs> years. Yeah. Oh, Madonna Pot Garden. When you have a Madonna Pot Garden, then I. Yeah, I, I had to, I got a tent and I got all the pots and everything. I'm just gonna have to transplant everything in the ice cream bucket. Her speak now, quiet now, wolf. Who, who was playing the skin flute there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. no skin flute. No skin flute, or you will she be electrocuted. Like Any more of that awesome. skin flute on this show, and you will be electrocuted. I will. Call you. <laughs> Thinking about getting a penis enlargement? Shut up now, man. Shh. Let her talk. Oh. Did you hear all the different kinds I have? Yes. Uh, oh, yeah. Just, oh, yeah. Uh, everything okay, you say well, is... I had to pay $60 a call from licensed producers. My girl. You're my girl. Isn't that unreal? Better go get that. Well, I had to. I thought I had to. Everybody else obviously just gets their license, gets five grams, and then it's, it gets five grams of their license, buys Turn it once up. in three it's months just to show they have their license, and up. then get a license to get five grams a, to grow a day, and uh, it don't make no sense to me. 
I, for some oh, reason, yes, assumed huh? you had to prove that you needed what you smoked, and when you had a licensed producer, that's how you paid for it. And obviously, I'm too stupid to realize oh, that I didn't have to do both of them. Over time. And go. It's just unreal. It's just unreal how they're going to legalize pot. But for everybody else, I've wanted my license for 20 years. I talked about having licensed marijuana licenses 20 years ago. And I get thrown in the quack house. And all of a sudden, it's been legal since 1979. And they've had medical users since 1979. And I get thrown into the hospital. Well, I still preached this You're shit 20 us. years ago when I needed it for post-traumatic stress disorder. And you sell I like Rosemary on the uh, Rosemary on uh, uh, Dick Van Dyke. Dick Van Dyke. Did you know that? <laughs> no. <laughs> you, <laughs> you do, Rosemary. You could play her. Really. <laughs> uh, I love you, girl. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Rosemary. Yes. You know who she... Yeah. Hmm. Who is she? <laughs> I'm not you even don't sure. Know who she, oh, my I'm sorry. Oh, don't worry about that. Go on. Yeah. About the oh, shut up. You, Go you, on about the marijuana. What, you know, about, like you uh, were saying, marijuana can uh, cure a lot of things. <laughs> you, you ever heard of uh, stress disorder is one of the best cures for if you have any stress in your life it's from the past due to traumatic events smoke weed bake beat weed bake weed put it on your brain I don't care it'll work <laughs> anything you would you like to come in here for a cupcake a and a glass of wine event in your life <laughs> brownies a traumatic event will cause you to have post-traumatic stress disorder <laughs> sprinkle it on your eggs tea and cookies <laughs> <laughs> as long as they got cookies for the yeah, rest of your as life they, you got they got, as long as they're made with anyway. green butter yes <laughs> I know how to make butter <clears throat> green butter She's so funny. I used to put it on my toast in the morning. Yeah, I do that too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so you, what? To explain how you do that for everyone. No, I can't do that. That's my secret. Okay, I'll I'll tell mine. <laughs> All you do is. I love her so much. Sometimes, Mike, but I'm not telling everybody. Okay, I'm going to tell you how I make mine. I take the okay. I take the marijuana. Sure. I yeah. I put it in a, a food blender, or something, or whatever. You got to pull the stalks or try to. Chop it up with a knife or whatever way you want to chop it up really good, oh. and then uh, <laughs> put it <laughs> half water, half butter, like real butter, real butter, and mm. simmer it, simmer it on the stove <laughs> till til the mix it and mix it and mix it. I don't know how long I can't remember till you think it's nuts. done. The, you don't want to overdo it because it'll it'll kill all the, nice all the THC. And then you, you right. just put it in the freezer. Reach in there and fish it out. That's right. It. That's exactly how you do it. You put it in the freezer. That's exactly how you do it. <laughs> and oh wait till the, the top turns into a green he, butter crust. And you pull that off and then you dump the shit water and stock out. And you might have to scrape a little the, bit of stock off the bottom side of the butter the chunk. One, the, yeah, that's the, exactly that's what it. I do. That's he it. um had trouble. Delicious. And it's something beautiful, man. <laughs> it is. And you can bake with it, and you don't have the pieces of st uh, stock and that, and it's just amazing. It tastes great too. What's it called it when it was like the rut? Do you um, know what we're talking about, Kurt? Egg. We're talking about making the best kind of butter you ever. Man, it's called green butter. It tastes great too. What heard all about? Nutty. It. It's really nutty, and it gives you a buzz. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, great. I love that. I love it's that. nutty. I love that. It's very nutty indeed. You're, yes. so, uh, you're so not. You're so stupid, though. <laughs> Can it's you very uh, nutty? One time. Right. Yeah. Oh, jackpot! <laughs> Lightning struck that lady. She'd love it. Do it one time for her. Uh, uh, inspire. What a great. Lady, uh, her testimony. I love her. Like, cute lighting. Sorry. Gosh, hmm. you missed it. 
What a great the thing that makes me really, really think hard. What a great really lady. Think hard She's so great. Is what makes me different oh, than all yeah. those people walking around St. Thomas in a fucking days. Oh, she What's said, you got, why have you not a cute lightning strike? Um, exactly. Oh, my oh, God. Thank I, you. I'm uh, not a vegetable. Wolf man. From all the drugs I was infected with and all the drugs I fucking been given by the government. She's waiting for a lightning strike, the girl. She's so pretty. And you're and still you're not still doing it. What? What is? Can, it can you? Uh, I know you have that button. How do you make the weed? We have a question oh, for you. I got. Yeah. How do you make Shh. the weed into hard candy? <laughs> that I don't know. I've never even tried it. Never Just even tried it. Lightning strike. I know you can bind it to any kind of fat. A lot of the LPs can, are binding it to. Uh, like coconut oil and yeah, you any can, kind of oils, sunflower oil, olive oil. Yeah, okay. Hey, we, what you could do is, is take the butter, though, and you could make chocolate pretty easily out of that. I that still would think be you're amazing. in a trailer. That would be amazing. You sound like you're in a trailer. And, and then a, you, could you could chop up the chocolate, the chocolate and then make it into cookies. cookies. Oh yeah! Uh, come over for some tea and cookies. <laughs> no, no, I will. <laughs> All right then. Tea and cookie. <coughs> yeah, that would be yeah, like really. <laughs> yes, cookie monster. <laughs> yes, cookie monster. We have a question for you. <laughs> okay. yeah, Do yeah. you have cookies? <laughs> no. We, I have uh, no cookies. Have a Cookie. Wolfman is so drunk. He don't know what he's doing anymore. I asked him Something to play. I'm right. sorry, girl. He's a mess. I'm sorry about Wolfman. Wolfman, shut up already. Just play. Stop now. Play. <laughs> <laughs> she, she don't know what else to do. You eat the rest of your house full of food. Too. Oh, my Lord. Tears in my eyes. I'm laughing. See? Oh, man. Oh, yeah. tomorrow, will you delete this show tomorrow? <laughs> this show? so hard. I've t- got delete. tears in my eyes here. Delete. Oh, boy. You were supposed to play lightning by now. She wanted to be lightning. But you know you're so stupid and drunk. You're light, like light beam. What, can you say that slower, Kurt? What, what's he talking about? Light. What did he say? Light beamed or what? Light, lightning. What does that mean? White lightning or something when you're up in the mountain and you white got lightning, a, yeah. stupid white lightning. No. <laughs> is that what it is? Oh, that good. Sounds that like that you had some good. white lightning. That lady was waiting for lightning, and you've been talking bunch of shit. Shut up. Well, I never like, said a word. Really. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Okay, we shut up now. You're stupid. Oh. No. Take me to I'm your leader. S- your earthlings make me very angry. Just play. I love that voice. That's <laughs> awesome. I remember that character. <laughs> oh, um, um, what was the name? Little. I just did that off. Uh, I just I just did that. Yeah. That wasn't a drop. That's awesome. <laughs> what was his name? What was, name? What was that oh, little yeah. earthling? I thank you to my leader. Yeah, that's Marvin the Martian. He was with Big Bugs Marvin Bunny. Marvin the Martian. Yeah. Yeah, that's him. Yeah. yeah. What's up, yeah. Now? Why haven't you played lightning oh, it's for you Marco again. yet? Lighting. Oh, it's what? you again. Play what are lightning. you doing here? Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> Look at those carrots. Trying to make some carrot patch, and you aliens are pissing me off. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do both. <laughs> oh, my lord. Oh, we can always get, um... Uh, what time is it where you live? 
It's um almost twelve o'clock here. Twelve eleven C four. Oh my lord. I love I love it. Dungeon Master. <laughs> uh, Dungeon Master. We separate the opponent. Jim Jones. Shut up. Shut up. Hey, girl. Hey, hey, girl. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Your opponent, uh, hey, girl. Your opponent will be released in a moment, and you will have to battle. Go. I, uh, Darren you has a question from the chat room. He said, uh, were the aliens where she lived, were they baptized? Hell <laughs> no. I don't think they were baptized at all. Uh-oh. <laughs> Do they believe in God? They believe in a higher being. Do they have, like, a religion where they, like, worship the, the, the higher being? No. Not religion. I mean, don't call it religion. To belief. It's either you have the belief or you don't. They all do. Do they have a name for the higher, the, this being? Not that I know of. Just that that's there. It's an entity. Hello, this is Marvin Spacey. I want to ask you. Just Can I ask, do the aliens have sex? When there was, is there female and male? No, it's, I'm allowed to talk, aren't I, Wolfman? <laughs> oh. Come on, Wolfie. Let him let him talk. Oh yeah, I have permission. I just one question. This is Marvin Spacey from. You're trying to mock no, her a little bit. No, I actually want to know if the aliens have male and female. Well, everybody have to have, you know. Uh, yeah, there are male, male and female, that. but they don't have sex the way we do. Oh yeah, I, I already. Um, right. I've been told about this actually that they they do it Which, like uh, in, a, in a, like she like she said they grow their babies they have to they can't do it anymore and that's why they're taking our Shh, DNA my brother now that's why that's why they're taking our DNA is what I've been told I don't know if it's uh, true but yeah. yeah I want to ask her now girl um yeah what do you think my about Chris girl I love you what do you think about <laughs> um Jim Jones and all he did, and as much as you love the Lord and all that, and he went and he believed that uh, Jesus was rose and died and all that, and he made everybody he made everybody uh, drink a sign that all babies died. What do you think about somebody like that, girl? I'm not sure. I would just say he's into himself too much. Huh? I'd say he's into himself too much. He doesn't care what other people think. He's putting out an opinion about whatever he wants to say. He don't care who likes it or not just to bring out a fucking uh, an extra buck. Do you remember that when that happened in 78 when he made all them die? No. No? Um... Then uh, Q, uh, Joe, um, uh, uh, YouTube, uh, uh, Jim, Jones. Jim Jones, YouTube right now, Q, right now, play, play. No, I don't want to. She's not, she's not really she's skilled not. with uh, computer stuff yet. Yeah. She didn't know about all that. Um, no, I didn't. You didn't know about all Jim Jones' tragedy. No, I didn't. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. okay. Where are you from on. anyway, Private? <laughs> Awful. Uh, 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 bad this bad. bad, this bad. Um, made a thousand people take sign on all his hollow. Awful. Awful. Q, uh, Wolfman, can you play that? Uh, I got something for you. No. Yeah. No, you're going to play something dumb. Yeah. 
It's the worst music ever. ever. You're gonna hate worst it. Worst man, my. Um, yeah. 2012. You're gonna hate this, gonna Kurt. Hate. Mm, sh- well, don't, don't, don't do that. Don't. It's it's the most ugliest song. That's n- don't it doesn't do fit. That. Oh, that's good. Yeah. No. Let's see Just if you're a good looking man. man. Right now, if you it's, can. It's, shh. Don't do this. Please don't. Time, but I slept. I was in my chamber sleeping all the time. Yeah, so you didn't know if they slept. So that, that's kind of creepy they too. Probably don't. Darren, oh. shut up! I told you. Oh man, so shut up! Long time ago. Do they have toenails and fingernails? Ooh, grays. I don't know. I can't remember that stuff. They, there's okay. no grays. It's all lies. Fake. Hmm. Anything like? Do they wear um, like nipple clamps or anything like that? No, 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 nothing like that. What? Why would that? Darren, <laughs> shut up! <laughs> I, I don't know. We're getting near the end of the show, so I like to be f- a little bit funny here. So no, everyone cheers. Okay, we no, got the show. Got to you know go on. I mean? <laughs> We got to go on <laughs> until the sun comes up. Then, <laughs> yeah, that'd yeah. be nice. I like to go up to the sun. Why do you have Darren like quicker than like a, a w- yeah? That's why I put that on quicker like than a, a ray of light. Uh, it, it, it the song actually has something Darren, to do with what, like, um, with the show because no. you, when you were whisked away and came back, you had to have been gone faster than the speed of light, quicker. Darren, oh yeah, like yeah. A, you sound like a uh, Disney character. You make it you. <laughs> This song's about abduction. She feels like she just got home. I wondered this before. It even 
different shows. You're spinning on the video and everything. Spot asleep and yeah. they hurt so bad. Oh. You know, I actually think that song might, she might possibly be talking she about alien abduction. Oh, <laughs> I'm not kidding. On, uh, in the, every, hidden in the lyrics. Disney character voice. Every, every aspect of uh, space travel is co- covered in that song. Can you bring Dern on in, like, Snoopy? Uh, Snoopy, I, he didn't talk much. <laughs> you brought on Darren, are you there? <laughs> Dar- <laughs> Darren. Space Out Radio says, when are they coming back to my house? Uh, do you mean... Uh, Darren's uh, supposed to the come aliens? on, right? Or, I'm not sure what he means. Is Darren there? Hello? Uh, yeah, I don't think he is. Uh, Jeff, are you there? Hello. <laughs> okay, what well, you got? Oh, any, my brother, any, anything, man? My You're getting near the end of the show. There's the so. man with the uh, best voice. There, hi, Jeff. Hello, Curtis. Hello, Jeff. How are you? Oh my uh, God. You're, well, there's there's a lot so of good great. questions in the chat room here. Can um, you hit some? Oh, a lot gotta, of good questions. I gotta find the chat room. I'm, I am not You're even a mess. on the Shut up. Mute. Shh. <laughs> well, um, I mean, a lot of questions are about uh, the alien children that she had, that Chris had. Um, you know, like, did she miss, does she miss them? Or, um... Think about them all the time. Do they ever, like, talk to you, uh, you know, communicate to you? No, I'd have to be schizophrenic at that point. I'd have Schizo- to be with, with them or in contact with them. I have telepathic communications with them. Really? Yeah, there's no communication now. I was told that there wouldn't be. Hmm. That's interesting. And um, when was the last time you talked to them? When they were eight. So in that time, I don't even know. It was only I was. It was three days time here, but it was eight years there, and I don't even know. It would have to be in their uh, early twenties. Have you aged like eight years being gone, or did you age like three days? No, you don't age at all. Not one wrinkle. I look exactly the same as when I had left, as when I come back. It was only three days' time frame here. Really? Wow. Yeah. So that oh, could mean that you actually may have just hallucinated it all while you were passed out for three days, possibly. I wasn't passed out. They said I was there. My friends were with me. They wouldn't have just let me faint yeah. on the yeah, ground. It's kind, and of, there. kind of hard to come up with eight right. years of eight years of memories, and how, yeah, yeah. That, that is kind of hard. To how come do up they with. How do they learn? Is there like a school that they go to? It would be like what we have here, but it's all. Um, you listen to the senior and. Everybody, there isn't a lot of this kids being little turkeys in class or trying to make jokes. It's everybody learning at the same time. It's like the information is embedded into each one of their heads as they're being told. It's not like, uh, I'll tell you this, and then they say no because I don't feel like it right now. It's like they embed the thought they want them to have in their minds when they're young. Did they say why they left you, like, naked when they dropped you off? No, they didn't say. Probably because, I don't know, just because I had no clothes. I had clothes when I left. I just didn't have any when I came back. You would think that if they were that smart that they would, you know...